What's up guys, LQ here with the LQ Review. Thank you so much for joining me here at my YouTube channel. Right now I wanna talk about the new film called Roleplay. So this film stars Kaylee Coco as a secret agent, an assassin, and her husband has no idea. Yes, this is true lies. <laughs> this is true lies that is um, gender reversed, where the female is the assassin and the male is the husband who has no idea what's going on. And this really mirrors true lies in a lot of ways, in the sense that the husband is feeling dejected, and he wants to rekindle that spark in the relationship, much like Jamie Lee, Lee Curtis's character was. Um, he's not... He's not running around with a pretend secret agent who's actually a car salesman, but the, the same character traits are there. And Kaylee Coco, the Arnold Schwarzenegger character, is a assassin who really wants to um, have a family life. So there's a lot of similarities here. Now, just to be clear, True Lies is by far the better movie. But I gotta tell you that I really enjoyed roleplay. It starts out with uh, him trying, like I said, he's trying to bring Spark back to the relationship, so they decide they're going to meet up at a bar and roleplay and uh, pretend they don't know each other. But while they're there, her life catches up with her. Things start to go astray, and he gets caught up in the mix of this, um, uh, of this plot to basically kill her or capture her. Kaylee Coco, who I really like from Big Bang Theory, I haven't loved a lot of her movie roles. I think she's been fine, but she hasn't really picked the greatest roles yet. This is probably my favorite movie role of hers. Obviously, Penny is still my favorite role that she has been in, but this has probably been my favorite movie role of hers. She's she's done a really good job of um, of portraying the family dynamic. She wants that family. She does a great job with the duality of this role. But surprisingly, she actually does a really good job with the physicality of this role. Her fight scenes, she sold them really well. And I appreciated that. So, so yeah, I, I, I liked this movie. Now, it's not going to end up in my top 10 of the year or anything like that. Um, I, you know, I, I would give it a thumbs up on a thumbs up scale. But if I were assessing a score to this, I'd say 6.5 or 7, meaning I liked it, but it wasn't great. Um, it was just a good, it was a fun way to spend 40, uh, an hour and 40 minutes. And sometimes that's all you're really looking for in a movie, is a nice way to pass a little bit of time. So if you have a little bit of time to spare, you could do a lot worse than this. I recommend checking it out. If you want to watch, the, if you haven't seen True Lies though, and you want to watch the Superior movie, True Lies is for sale on Vudu and and other um, VOD services. True Lies is the better movie, but you could do a lot worse than Role Play. I definitely enjoyed it. All right, guys, what did you think of Role Play? Let me know in the comments below. Thank you for joining me here at the OQ Review, and until next time, we'll see you guys later.